Hey YouTube, this is your homeboy Seth Martial Art Fitness, and I want to talk to you about progress. <laughs> progress is a thing. It's motivation to keep you going. You know, on topics you want to get better at, subjects you want to get good at, or sports you want to get good at. Um, that's the thing. Progress is a thing where you can try to improve, and a lot of people don't get that. They think, oh, they can learn everything in one night. No. You can't learn everything in one night. It takes time, years, dedication to get better at the things you do. And that's what I call progress. You know, you learn you learn from your mistakes over time. You, when you fail at things and when you fail at things, you learn to get back up and start over again. So, when you fail, fail at things and you keep failing and failing, just keep trying. Because you will get better at it. You will, get, you will progress at it. When, when you stop trying, you fail yourself. That means you won't get progressed in anything you do. Because if you have a goal in mind, if you have a goal in mind, then if you have a goal in mind that you want to do and you want to get better at it, whatever craft you're studying or whatever thing you're doing, um, it's up to you. You know, you gotta want to do it to progress it. Because if you don't, if you don't, I man, if you don't show any progress. Progress in it, progress in it, and um, you'll never improve. You gotta stay with it every day. You gotta stay with your craft, whatever you want to do every day to get better at it. And I've been practicing with the sword, the Japanese sword, almost since I started doing martial arts and now it's like before I'm done martial arts I've been practicing with the sword and and I've just gotten better at it I've learned from different people I learned how to use the sword and it, they taught me some things how to maneuver with it and to improve on my sword techniques um Sometimes I'll learn on YouTube videos to on different things on how to do things, um, and then I'll just try it out. You know, if I like it, and if I don't like it, then I won't use it. Um, but no matter what, I always progress. You know, because I never give up at what at anything I do. I never give up on myself. No matter how many times I fail at things, I always keep trying. So once you keep trying, that means you are improving. And that's the reason why a lot of people don't get where I'm coming at. Because I see things totally different than what other people see in things on life. And the thing of it is, you just gotta strive. You gotta strive to better yourself. That's called progressive. So when when you want to progress in your life, you gotta ask yourself some questions. That's how you know how you want to progress. Do I really want this? I say you want to get a house to live in of your own, instead of being under the wing of your grandparents or under the wing of your mom and dad, whoever you're staying with. Well, first, you gotta progress and find a job. Make that money. And then, then once you start finding a job, make that money, save up, set goals, and then find you a place to live. And then you gotta, if you don't drive, then you gotta figure out, okay, I gotta get a car. Save up for a car after that. You know, or save up for a car first, then work on <laughs> saving up, buy you a place. Now that's called progression and setting goals. And that's what I did. 
you know, I always set progression and goals, and you know, through everything I do, and that's, and that's what motivates me, because I strive for everything I do in life, and I guess you could say I'm a fighter, I guess you could say I'm a warrior, because I never throw in a towel, I treat life like a boxing match, you know, you got, you got 12 rounds, well, they're a whole boxing match. Well, if you can get past the first three rounds in life without throwing in the towel, then you just go on to the fourth stage, the fifth stage, you know, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, eleven, twelve, you know, whatever, you know. And go through them stages on what goals you want to set to progress to better yourself at your craft. Whatever it is that you do in life. You know, if you want to be a better motivation speaker, um, basically, you just got to practice at it. You just got to basically just practice at your craft and what you want to do. Like, like if you want to be a motivation speaker for YouTube, you know, you got to practice at it. And, that you know, to get better at your craft and what you want to do on, on YouTube. And I've learned a lot of things over the years being on YouTube, and, um, I noticed I've gotten more subscribers, I want to thank you for all the new people that have subscribed to my channel, thank you for being the family of me, and I just want to say you guys are a blessing to me for being on my channel, and everything, and I learned a lot from a lot of other YouTubers out there, like Sean G, TR Ron, uh, truck fitness uh, he's like a diesel driver um, I learned a lot from him um, I learned from Jesse Incat off his videos and stuff like that send some words out to <laughs> to those um, to those people because they inspired me to make my YouTube channel and and even Zendray, I know I I'm, I'm talked to Zendray a few times on Instagram and everything, and he's a really cool guy down to earth. You know, he's really knowledgeable of his stuff. Um, one day I would like to train with him, or I would like him to come here and train with me, and you know if he can ever do it, and. Uh, but other than that, I mean, it's just progress, you know, progress in everything you do, that's the key to life, you know, to better yourself, to get stronger, like if you want to get strong in calisthenics, weightlifting, um, martial arts, or reading, or drawing, whatever it may be, playing music. If you want to get better at whatever you want to do in life, you got to progress, keep at it, and no matter what, how challenges get hard, whatever it is that you want to do, never throw in the towel. That's all I'm saying. Never throw in that towel because you don't want to give up on yourself because that ain't no way to progress. So, I'm just being real. And... 100%. The way you progress is to better yourself at your craft every damn day. And I better myself five days a week. You know, I treat it like a child. I also like to have fun with it too. So I don't just do it just to do. I do it because I want to progress. I want to progress in my craft. It's something that I love doing. You know, the reason why I make my martial art videos on a class set manner is because that's how you would do it in an actual class, in an actual dojo. You would do reps. I mean, you would do sets. Uh, let's say in an hour's time, you might learn five techniques, and you'll do them 20, 20 times in a line. And on, a, on a dot and on the mat and in an hour's time so 
And plus, you do your conditioning you're on top of it. And so, I do it on a, a class set, set manner. A lot of people may not like my videos because of it. Me, I don't really care. It's my continent, my channel. I'll do how I want to do things. Um, I'm not, I mean, I'm still new to things. And like I said, I'm not no pro at things. Um, but it's just having experience on what I do is what I do. And that's how I learn from a lot of other people is, you know, it's gain friendship, gain bond, and uh, learn from one another. And when you learn from one another, you improve, you progress, share knowledge at the same time, and basically just, you know, go with on what you love doing. That is the most important thing. You gotta have love for what you do, and most of all, you gotta have the heart to what you wanna do. And, and that, that's the thing, you know, most people don't have the heart to do what they wanna do. Yeah, they, they might want, they might love what they wanna do, but they they don't really want to show that they have a heart for it to progress to better themselves and, that, and that's the thing you know you gotta have the heart for everything you do in, in your craft to get better at what you do even in things in life if you want to get good at cooking, you know, you gotta get, learn to get better at it, learn on YouTube, that's how I did it, I didn't know how to cook all that well, I learned a lot of things just by watching videos on how to cook, and I just started teaching myself how to cook, and I don't know, a lot of people say I'm a good damn cook when, when they come over, and to eat, so me, honestly, it's just... You gotta learn to practice on what you do in life because you gotta progress at your craft to be able to survive, to be able to do what you love doing. But most of all, progress on having a heart for what craft or skill you want to get good at. Learn to progress. That's the key. Please hit the like, hit subscribe, hit that bell notification. I'll see you. Hit all. And if you are new to this channel, like I said, thank you for joining Seth Martial Arts Fitness. And subscribe, hit all on the bell. You'll get every one of my videos. And like I said, I don't post that much, but I do try to post every once in a while. It's just when I have the time. So there you have it. Please hit the like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. And I'll see you in the next video. Train hard, train smart. Do your research. Learn to progress. Peace.